What is up y'all? Bo, the Cajun Tow Boater, coming at y'all with another review and it is the Power Rangers Lightning Collection RPM Yellow Ranger Summer Lansdowne and um, this figure just from the box and everything it looks it looks pretty cool it's our first Ranger from uh, RPM and um, one of the last figures we'll be getting for a good year with the break um, a single release like this but uh, RPM, if you don't know about it, it takes place in a alternate timeline uh, where the computer virus Vengex has taken over and wiped out a lot of mankind. But there's a, um, I can't remember the Dome City's name, but uh, they're, they're there and the mentor for that season, Dr. K, who you find out later also created the Vengex virus, um, helps create the... RPM Power Rangers and um, don't call the suits spandex <laughs> around her but uh, that was a great season the way they the way they took that and put it in a, like another timeline and uh, or another universe and stuff like that um, it was very very interesting so it's it surprised a lot of people whenever they tied it all together and you see some of the uh, Rangers from different timelines working with the Rangers from the RPM timeline in other seasons. But let's go ahead and take a look at the box. So there you go. She looks good. She's got her baton, her blaster. Her um, I love how the blasters look like the gas pump uh, handles. Um, you got her lightning effect, her... Um, extra pair of hands, her civilian head, and her helmet, and they all look good. So you got that side with her helmet, you got that artwork on this side, and then you have the back. So let's not waste any more time, let's go ahead and move over to the desk and take the figure out of the box and check it out. Alright y'all, and here she is out of the box, and um, yeah, she looks pretty good. Um, I really cannot complain about how she looks. Um, I took a look at it and I haven't found any imperfections yet. But I will go ahead and take a better look at it. As soon as... I um, take her off the turntable, but let's take a look at her accessories first. So you have the lightning effect. You have her, sorry y'all, extra pair of hands. It's just open hands, and she's got gripping hands. This is one of the first Rangers in a while that... I mean, don't quote me on this, but I see that don't come with a uh, just a closed fisted hand. Got her blaster, which like I said, is just I've never noticed that they're shaped like gas pumps. Um, and it's, oh, sorry, oh, that wasn't supposed to happen. I, it's, it's just funny because it's a car season, is what I was going to say. And there's her baton or sword whatever you want to call it and her helmet and her helmet looks pretty good all right so um like i said i'm go, gonna go ahead and take her off the turntable and check her out a little bit more for any imperfections just to make sure that uh i didn't miss anything all right y'all and here she is off of the turntable so let's go ahead and take a look at her Alright, um, yeah, I was right. I'm not seeing any imperfections. Uh, she's got an ab and torso crunch. Her head can't look up or down much because of the hair. It stops it. She does do a full 360 and she has a bicep swivel. She's got double jointed elbows. She's got a wrist swivel for the glove. Her hand can't go up or down much um, because of the 
cuff of the, where the glove is. She's got butterfly joints. She can split that much. The skirt pushes it back down. She can't kick up much because of the skirt. But she does have a thigh swivel. And double jointed knees. With a boot swivel. Her foot can go down this much. And can go up that much. Um, I do like how her blaster hangs just like the pump, the gas pump. So it just goes like this. Uh, if I can get it on there without breaking. Sorry, y'all. And I'm knocking everything down. I mean, it's been a while since I watched RPM. I'm not sure if that's exactly how the blaster goes, but that's how it fits on there. So this is a a pretty good figure. Um, I give this one a 10 out of 10. It looks great, um, moves great. It's not no imperfections, no um, no stiffness or anything. Uh, just can't move the head because of the um, because of the hair so if you got this figure and you uh, like it or didn't like it or if you're glad that they're doing they did different teams between besides Mighty Morphin and some of the other ones um, let me know down in the comments like comment subscribe um, let me know um, your likes about it your dislikes about it anything you may have found wrong with it um, if you guys accidentally got the wrong figure in the box like I've seen happen to a few people let me know but if you search Facebook Instagram or TikTok for the Cajun Toe Boulder you can find me on there and um, you can message me on there as well um, you can talk to me about Power Rangers talk to me about the lightning collection you can talk to me really about anything um, doesn't matter I'll, uh, I'll pretty much talk about anything but I want to thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for subscribing. Just overall, thank y'all for taking this journey with me. And as always, I will see y'all in the next one. <laughs>